This is the place. This little unassuming. So you can't come in, Tyler, and film the makeup. What? Because there's other women in there. Why am I here? But I can take you can take pictures when I'm done with the makeup. I don't know. She just said no, but she said I could go come get this, so it's... I'm so sorry. Okay. Bye. Bye, I'm sorry. Okay, so geisha makeup. This was definitely the longest part of the makeover because there are a lot of steps to achieving the perfect geisha look. So the first thing that my makeup artist Nami did was clean my face in preparation for the makeup, which I thought I had done this beforehand, but apparently I didn't do a very good job because this took way longer than I anticipated. After my face was prepped, she applied a very thick wax. So this wax is hard and it's melted by rubbing it in your hands and then it was spread all over the face. She did two layers of this and this will help the white makeup go on a lot smoother. The next step was the actual makeup. They used a lot of different shades of white, pink, and red for the look, and the first layer was the iconic white face. This was a very thick, very cold paste applied in two layers. Before she started on the face, she painted the back of my neck with two lines and then a half circle in the middle, and they do this to make the neck appear longer and more beautiful. So I never really knew why geishas did their makeup with this white paste, but I did find out. And hundreds of years ago, when there was no electricity, geishas were performing in really dark rooms that were only lit by candlelight. So they painted their faces this way to make their features more noticeable and stand out in the darkness, which actually makes a lot of sense, and they continue doing this today. Point the face. <laughs> <laughs> okay. After the base was finished, Nami asked me if I wanted cute or elegant makeup. I honestly couldn't really tell the difference, so I asked what she suggested, and she said elegant, so we went with that. Oops. What do you think is better? Mm. Elegant? Okay. Okay. That works. Yeah. <laughs> Next up was eyebrows and eye makeup. So I don't know how I never knew this before, but geishas actually paint red on their eyebrows as well as their eyelids, which was a really fun surprise for me. And they add the color to these areas because apparently if they did just the white makeup without the red, then you would look too white, almost like you were dead. So they add the red, which symbolizes blood, meaning you are in fact alive. After the red makeup was done, Nami put eyelid stickers on my eyelids to make my eyes look more open. And I feel like I've seen this in an advertisement like years ago somewhere and I thought it was kind of silly. But listen, I was proven wrong because they actually did make a huge difference. White. Wow, mm. that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Please cross your eyes. So at this point, we are reaching the end of the makeup. So she did some eyeliner and then she did the lipstick. And the lipstick was really interesting because as you can see, she is drawing the red line quite a bit under my natural lip line, which is something I am not used to seeing like nowadays out and about. And they do this though on purpose because they believe it makes the lips look more cute and proportionate to your other features. Mm, wow, beautiful. <laughs> Next, the bottom eyeliner. After adding some final touches, like a little more red under my eyes and mascara, the makeup look was finally complete. It was so fun to have a look that was so far from anything I had ever seen myself in. And it definitely took me a minute to get used to it. And I, I felt like I couldn't really like move my face or have facial expressions because of all of the stuff that was on it. But I absolutely loved it. Makeup done. Mm -hmm. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Like it, yeah. 
Thank you. Thank you. じゃあ、next hair を行くね。Oh, okay. Okay? Yes. Can I use your bangs hair? Sure. Okay.、Mm -hmm. So going into this, I had absolutely no idea how on earth they were going to make my hair look like a geisha's hair. So I was very intrigued to see what she was going to do. So the first thing she did was she took out all of the hair around my face and then she put the rest of it back in a wig cap. After that, she went and she got just an actual wig and she put it on my head. It makes so much sense and it made things a lot easier. Then she took my real hair pieces and combed them back around the wig so that it would look cohesive like it was all my hair. So, what if my hair would have been a lighter color? What would they have done then? So, they would have had to spray the front of my hair black so it would have matched the rest of the wig, but luckily I was already a pretty good match. After all the hairs were in place, she put a little ribbon on top and the hair was done. <laughs> All done. All done. Okay.、Mm. okay. Do you like it? Yes, I love it. Okay.、Mm -hmm. Next, a kimono dress up. Okay. Do you like it? You think you look right? I think I look right, do you? I think it looks pretty good. <laughs> I mean, how could I not look right, right? Oh man, that's cute. Now we have 10 minutes of free time to do whatever we want, so we're doing half here, half in the studio. So, I guess it's time to go to the studio. We've been in here a little bit. Good though. So I'm curious how this all is gonna come off because she has like, it's like caked on a clump of wax and she was just like rubbing it and then she was like wiping <laughs> it all over my face. Just peels、neck. your skin off. Your wig looks like it's like so low. It's kind of cool. Yeah, she like literally sewed it onto my head. What? She had like this big needle thing and like thread and she put it through here. And then I went through a bunch of times and then tied it at the top. What? <laughs> so it's like in here pretty good. Alright, was it worth it? Yay! Was it, was it fun leaving、know. me abandoned in the room while you got your makeup done? Whatever, that wasn't my choice. <laughs> <laughs> so happy. I love this kind of stuff. It was so fun. I feel like I need to get my teeth whitened after this. I feel like, oh my gosh. And I wasn't really locked out there for that long, so. Yeah, you have it. I got、right. to see most of it. I got to yeah, see the kimono、yeah. thing. I got to go out in the courtyard. I got to do this. So, just the makeup. <laughs> just leaving. Was it good? Yes. Best day ever? I got the makeup off, took like 500 makeup wipes, and then they like had me go actually wash my face. There's like face, face wash and everything. So, my contacts are absolutely wrecked, but I think I was supposed to take them out, but like, why? Because I'm blind. But it was so fun. I loved it. every second of it. It was totally amazing to do. 
Anyway, 10 out of 10 recommend. <laughs> Glad you had fun.